Hi, good evening. Uh, it's Mexi here, and I came to do a tutorial on a view of how it is to wear colored brows. Um, I saw this on one of the girls on the Makeup Alley that likes to do her brows all the time in so many different colors. And so what I did is I took out a, t a blue aquamarine liner and I did my brows in this color and then I went in with a liquid liner and I did a cat eye and I just applied foundation now I haven't done anything else with the rest of my face but I'm going to go in and I'm gonna be wearing a dark lip today this is gonna be like some kind of retro look so hopefully you like it um, I know it's not for me but I just wanted to try something different so I'm going to go ahead and do some contouring and I will then add in some eyeshadow and some lipstick and top it off and show you the look when I completed. Okay, so now I've gone in and I've done sculpting here and I'm going to do my nose area and define that area and I've done the sculpting on this side as well. As you can see, what I did is I put... Uh, contour here and then I do is I like to apply the white underneath and then I put highlighter up here to give it more definition so it really stands out to give it that chiseling effect so that's what I've done on both sides now I'm going to blend in the nose area so now I went ahead and I defined the nose and blended that out and as you can see here so here's the color of the eyebrows and the liner I was thinking not to do any shadow but I'm gonna do an old school method this is what I used to do in high school it was very popular then and I'm gonna do it right now we used to take eyeshadow and wear it as lipstick so I'm going to choose a color that's similar to the shadow and then I'm going to apply it with this dark shade of this lipstick here and um, and I'm going to wear this black shade lipstick first I'll do the blue I'll remove it and then I'll wear the black so so you can see the two different looks so I think I won't add any yeah actually I will do blue lips I'm gonna add some a pop of the color uh, shadow and then I'm going to erase the lips and I'm going to go in and do the black lips so hang tight for that okay so I went ahead and I put it on my cosmetic tape and I'm going to take this color by MAC called Blue Jewel it is very close to the color that are on my brows I'm going to put a little bit of this on the eyes and then I'm going to use it on my lips this is really going to be shocking I don't think I need to prime I'm going to put a little bit of primer on my lips and then I'm going to go in with this so let's get into it I'm going to take a small sponge type applicator brush and I'm going to apply it onto the, apply the color onto there and just go across here. All that in. Careful not to go over your black liner because that just defeats the purpose. <laughs> and I'm going to kind of create a line up over the black. I don't know how good this is going to work. It's just a whole cre homemade creation I had conjured up in my head. should have used primer on the lid. I didn't use any because I wasn't planning on using any shadow but you know change your mind do what you want get the creative mind of flowing and the brushes start going okay so I'm gonna go in with this here 
darken that up a little just a little this ought to be interesting <laughs> probably a sick mess okay so now I'm going to take some primer I guess I will take I'll use Urban Decay Primer Potion. Unscrew the lid there. Apply a little bit. Just a little bit. I said a little bit. And I went nuts. Mm hmm. This is the first time using eyeshadow primer on the lips. This will be interesting to see if it pulled. Especially I'm not using it with lipstick, I'm using it with the shadow. Now this is what we used to do when I was in high school, okay? Just to create that frosty look because we loved frost. But this is more a uh, matte, so here we go. Interesting. I haven't done this in years. We used to use white a lot. And used to go to those uh, new wave uh, dance clubs. It's, that was the thing. Well, that's fun. Wow. <laughs> you want some matte finish, boy. That's some matte finish. Now I'm going to take this off. And this. Totally retro. This is like a rocking the 80s look. What do you think? I'm going to line my lips with blue. I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the finished look. I did my eyes. The eyebrow. The sculpting. And the old school matte lips. With just a blue eyeshadow like I said the colors uh, blue jewel from Mac I used this one I put primer from Urban Decay on my lips first and then I applied this after I could have like darkened it up more but because you could get like the patchy spots but I just wanted to mess around and try this out and show you an old look that I used to do. Well, the colors on the eyebrows weren't in, but the lipstick, uh, we used to do this with like white and pink. It was a lot of fun. So I hope you liked the look. I know a lot of you like this. This is kind of like people that wear this color hair. It looks really cute, but I don't think it looks too cute for me. And I just wanted to try this out. So. Now I promised to do the black lipstick, so let me go ahead and remove this color and try it with the black. And here is the lips. In black. I don't know, guys, because this you see how small this print is? And my eyes are shot. I cannot see that. So if anybody recognizes this little tube, and the color is of this shade it smells like cupcakes it almost smells like if it's Mac god I wonder if it is Mac it's not Mac here's the um, has some kind of emblem on it 
Oh my goodness. I hate this is the illness that I have. I can't see nothing, but there's like a little emblem on the lid. I thought it was like Kat Von D. Oh my god, it is Kat Von D. I am so slow. It is Kat Von D. Okay, so this is Kat Von D. <laughs> I could see that part of it once I flirt it up, so. Mm -hmm. I just love it. It makes your teeth stark white. Mm -hmm. Okay, so anyway, so this is the color. This would be nice for a vampy look. I should probably do another tutorial one day. I like doing vampy looks. I, I, I guess must have been gothic or something in my past life. Or vampire or something. I'm so witchy. I love witches. Like, real witches and costume witches. And they're so... Not the ugly haggardy witches, but like, just something about it. So, the, um... Look, guys, I hope you like it. Now I'm really starting to like this. Almost like it has a glimmer in it. Thanks for looking. Have a blessed night. I hope that you give me a thumbs up and comment. Let me know what you think about this look. I didn't do anything with my hair. I just kind of kept it. Up. I washed it and it's clean and I just kind of threw it up in a headband, you know. And um, this whole like whatever look. So hope you like it because I was just more concentrated on the face. So I hope you enjoy this look. And um, see you around the next video. Oh, do my tag video, guys. Hope you like it. And stick around for something new on another day. Mwah. Have a blessed night. Bye.